Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Allie if you're new and welcome to Beauty with the Purpose. If you are new, I upload three videos a week, Beauty, Bible, and Lifestyle. So if any of those interest you, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button and let's get into today's video. So for today's video, I have for you guys my everyday glam makeup routine. And of course, we're starting out with moisturizing the lips and then we're gonna get into primer. And I'm just gonna use my Smashbox Primerizer, my Hard Candy Primer, and my NYX Bear With Me Setting Spray. Going in with brows, I'm taking my LA Girl Shady Slim Brow Pencil in Darkest Brown, Blackest Brown, one of the two. And we're just going to go ahead and outline with that. And after we are out, after we are done outlining our brows, we are going to go ahead and start filling them in with the NYX Lift and Snatch um, Brow Pen. I love this look right here for a really bold but simple but natural lash, lash, brow. So yeah, I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. So to clean up our brows, we are going in with the Catrice True Skin Concealer. I absolutely love this concealer. It's just perfect. I don't know if I'm ever going to get over this concealer, but I use that to prime my lids and, like I said, clean up my brows. So for eyeshadow, quote unquote, <laughs> Um, I'm taking just my bronzing palette that I'm going to be bronzing my face with and I'm throwing that into the crease just to add a little bit of color. So it adds a little something but not too much. And then we are also going to take the blush that we are using and throw that into the crease as well. So for mascara, I'm taking my Revlon Big Bad Lash Mascara. You guys, this mascara is so good that you could, that I could have easily just left it there and my eyelashes would have looked beautiful. But of course, I'm so extra and I do end up going in with lashes. And the lashes that I end up using are the Iconic Light Lashes from the brand House of Lashes. Okay, so of course after lashes are applied we're going in with the skin and I'm going to use the Essence Pretty Natural Skin Tint Foundation. I'm not, I can't remember the exact name of it, but you guys, I absolutely love this. And I do a little slow down right here where I show you what it looks like with and without and it's just very much your skin but better and you can build up the product and I just cannot get over this. I'm actually going to apply it right now. Alright, and for concealer, I'm taking the e.l.f. Flawless Brightening Concealer. I use this to brighten up the skin, of course, and to get a little bit of, con like, con like, to conceal just a tiny bit. Sorry, I lost my words. But even after this, I'm going to take just a tiny dot of the Catrice True Skin right on the inner corners of my eyes, just to help cover up those dark circles that I have. And now to set the skin, I'm going in with the Tarte Shape Tape Translucent Setting Powder. I absolutely loved this powder with this particular foundation, but because I could only use it with one powder, I did go ahead and declutter it, but this combo right here that I have done is beautifully, beautifully amazing. So now we are going to go ahead and go in with our cream products. I'm taking my e.l.f. Putty Bronzer and I have learned that a lot of cream products actually apply really well and really beautiful on top of your setting powder and they blend amazingly and last all day. And so I have the Putty Bronzer in the shade Tan Lines. Alright, and for blush, I'm taking the Peerlessy BB Glow Blushes, and I did go ahead and only take the shade Coral, 
and yeah again another cream product on top of a powder I've just been loving the way that this looks and how long it lasts and now for powder bronzer blush and highlighter I'm going into the two palettes that I did go ahead and throw in my crease so the Alamod Cosmetics complexion trio palette and then for blush the elf um, blush duo and we're gonna use that one for highlighting and blush Alright, and now to finish up the lower lash and just to finish up the eyes in general, we're taking this Otticelli eyeliner in chocolate and we're just going to put that in our waterline. I feel like brown is a really good way to add a pop but something that's still subtle for an everyday glam makeup look. And then of course for our lower lashes, we will be using the Revlon Big Bad Lash Mascara again as well. For lips, I'm going to go ahead and use this NYX lip liner in the shade brown and I'm just going to outline and kind of fill in the edges. We're leaving the center blank but we're filling in the edges just to add some contouring to the lips. And after that I'm going to take my Holika Holika Holly Pop lip tint and I believe that I have it in the shade Beat. To set our brows, I'm using my Essence Make Me Brow Make Me Brow Brow Gel in Brownie Brows. How many times can I say brows? And we're just gonna go ahead and set down the brows with that. And then to set our entire face, I'm using the Ciate London Coconut Everyday Vacay Coconut Setting Mist, and obviously I love it because I did a little dance, but it truly is my favorite setting mist. And alright you guys, this is my everyday glam. This is my go-to look. Um, if you guys enjoyed it, please go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Please, please, please. And if you haven't already, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I love you guys, but always remember that Jesus loves you more. Mwah!